Well, I'm Bo Gorsesky. Today we will be exploring Verso Learning. It's an app that can be used for looking at student responses focused on deeper levels of thinking. Before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit that bell to enable notifications by clicking our logo during the video. Also, leave us a comment or check out our related videos by clicking at the pop-up cards in the upper right hand corner. Before we get started, we do want to acknowledge Miss Jeannie Daly as again our guest star for the Dear Disc channel. Today she's going over student responses for Verso. Don't forget part one. I am going to attempt to show you uh, what responses look like. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to do that, but I did. Um, uh, let's see here. Uh, I did uh a lesson with a group and i'm not sure that their responses are still here let's look at impact all right let's look at uh, no i'm not going to be able to show you their comments because it's no longer live uh but anyway um one of the things that, one of the things that most intrigued me about Verso uh, when um, I first saw it was the fact that when students go into Verso uh, and when they respond to that prompt, they cannot determine who the other people are in that room. The names are not associated with uh, with that response, and so I can't tell that that was Johnny's. As a, as a student, I cannot tell that that was Johnny who wrote that. Uh, it simply has, um, I think it's a number attached to it. Uh, and so if I read Johnny's response, and I really like that idea, but I feel like I have something else that he might want to consider or the student might want to consider, then I can respond to Johnny and say, have you considered blah, blah, blah. Uh, and so it's just a real... Um, uh, collaborative opportunity for kids in a non-threatening way. Now you might say, okay, how will I know if one of my kids acts up and, you know, wants to use profanity or really is rude to another um, participant? What, um, what, what can I do? Or, or how will I know who said it? Uh, you have a view that has their names attached to. So if, if um, Susie thinks that was a dumb thing that Johnny said and said, that was really a stupid thing you said, um, uh, then you can correct uh, that student in, in real time. Uh, so um, it has that, anon uh, you know, that anonymous, um, feel about it. Uh, and um, I think students appreciate that because it does open up the voices of, it has the potential of opening up the voices of some kids who just don't feel comfortable in speaking out in class. And, you know, when you engage them in a provocative question, you hear crickets. Well, if I'm in the Verso world, I might be more likely to respond on uh, First of all, because I can't see the response of others until I respond um, at least one time. So there's that piece that uh, actually promotes uh, equal participation for all students because, um, you, like I said, you can't see anybody's response until you write one yourself. Uh, and so, um, and Verso also has a lot of other features that are exemplary. They have an exit ticket feature that's that's great. Uh, they have um, an engagement um, uh, feature inside Verso that keeps track of student responses and how engaged they are in, um, in uh, the activities. Uh, you get a wealth of activities already created inside that library. Um, it is an easy program to to use. Um, I think if you talk to middle school teachers, you would, um, you feel very comfortable and uh, I feel very comfortable in saying that they, you know, wholeheartedly embrace uh, what Verso, uh, what Verso's potential is. Uh, and um, if you're in high school, uh, if you're a high school teacher, uh, these kids are already familiar with Verso. Um, chances are, uh, if they've been in, attended any one of our middle schools, they've had some Verso experiences already. So, um, 
please let me know if I can uh, answer any of your questions. Please let me know if you would uh, like some additional professional development. I can create a screen screencast that shows you exactly how to sign up. Should you be interested, I could do a Google Meet with you that will take you through this process. Um, just, just let us know how we can be of service to you. But I recommend Verso um, for being um, a tool that really can um, facilitate the deepening of the thinking of students. Anyway, this is Jeannie Daly. Let me know how I can help you. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, or reply to one of our other videos, or share the playlist below. Subscribe to our channel and enable notifications so that you don't miss out on the next episode. Don't forget to check out our other resources like this cast podcast and see what else is going on in Horry County Schools. Be sure to follow at Dear Disses on social media or contact us via email or our blog.